Hey everybody, Sneaky Narcotic, back at it again with another YouTube video, and now we're going to get into the third episode of uh, Journey to the uh, Savage Planet, and I've, I've really been enjoying this game recently, I, I don't know what it is, but it's like, I guess the culmination of Slime Rancher plus Borderlands to me, it was, uh, feels about right for this. So, we've made it to four out of six zones, although it's saying that we have something over here. Um, close to the Gzurfs. We want to go to this spot because it says that we have something over here. Um, here. Yeah, it's saying to go this way. And then where? Up. Okay, well... I know that we can go up this way. <clears throat> well, Pansy didn't want to see me. There we go. Could have made all of this explode. So let's see where it says to go next is this away. Um, hmm. Ooh, that wasn't useful. I, oh yeah, I can go up to these uh, big mushrooms. And throw a big mushroom at the small mushroom. Or at that thing. Yeah. Okay. So that opened up. Looks like we can eat that. Nice. See if there's something this way, maybe. Get some more silicon here. Okay, and there is fall damage in this game. I need to remember that part. Um, hmm. I feel like they just introduced the whole climbing mechanism. Surely there's somewhere to climb up here. I mean, we've still got a long way to go. Ah, there it is. Trying to remember. Okay, that's what I thought. Right. Trying to remember how to uh, exactly do that. Where's my glove? There we go. There's a grob. Okay. So I don't think I can just throw the grapple seed right there. Yeah. Maybe I need to jump right here. Oh, that didn't feel right. Maybe I need to jump right here. That's something. That's a silicon vein. Alright, okay, I think I know what I need to do now. I need to go down here to one of the big mushrooms and 
do that. No? Huh. I am thoroughly confused right now with this puzzle. Okay, so... There's one. Uh, there's another. Maybe, uh, yeah, I guess I just jump. I didn't realize I could jump that far. Silly me. Okay, so that's where we start to throw the uh, grapple seat. Right? Yeah. There we go. Oh, shit. Ow. Oh. Ooh, I didn't think I made that jump for a second there. That's right, get you some. I got him, I got him, guys. What was that? A Crag Claw defeated. Alright. Felt good, guys. Felt good. Good. I hope this is the explosion upgrade. That'd be nice. Great. Now that we've analyzed this water, Ugh, I need some aluminum. Aluminium. Let's see where this takes us. God, gotta love loading screens, man. It shouldn't be this long. I don't understand. Analyzing the data that you have recovered, I can find no easy way to open the door 
power from this location. That said, I am detecting various connections to devices and systems high above your current location. I am adjusting your compass to reflect this new information. Okay, I don't want to be here just yet. I feel like there's still some stuff that I should be uh, doing over here. New messages are waiting for you at the Javelin. Okay, there's new messages waiting for me. I'm going to see if I can make it to the last teleporter in the landing site area. See, it's called the Itching Fields. I like this song. I wish I could play the banjo like this. Assuming it's a banjo? Oh, now we can, yeah, read some of these messages here. From Monocorp First Galactic Bank of Commerce. Greetings, client, da da da. We are here at the Monocorp First Galactic Bank of Commerce, a proud member of the Globo firm, uh, Globoverse family of corporations and financial subsidiaries. Uh, are delighted to share with you wonderful developments in your financial status. As of today, your shaking, your checking account, I guess, uh, a balance is now 492237 while this level of debt. Uh, Oh, negative. Oh, my God. While this level of debt may seem substantial with your recent promotion to Intergalactic Explorer combined with its accompanying 2% bump in annual salary, we can now project that you will likely be free and clear of debt in, the, in as little as 47 years. This project, uh, projection represents a significant step down from your previous projection of 51 years and puts you well above average in terms of debt estimation, uh, elimination among the general population, after carefully careful review of these recent developments, the decision has been made to downgrade the status of your debt from crippling to deeply debilitating. Uh, congratulations and keep up the good work. Financial freedom is a mere half century away. Yeah, I thought I heard my wife walk in for some reason. Um. Kindred Weather Network, good morning. Summer has officially arrived in Montreal. As temperature continues to rise, we expect to see a week of highs and lines with the average seasonal range of 120 uh, to 150 Fahrenheit based on the last 15 years of weather data. As we typically suggest during this time of year, try to stay indoors as much as possible and keep direct exposure to the sun under uh, to under 30 seconds. If you're planning a day out, be sure to pack a sunscreen of at least SP, uh, SPF 350 and remember to literally reapply every 5 to 10 minutes. Here's your 7 day forecast. Monday 122, Tuesday 125, 152, 44, 44 degrees Fahrenheit, Thursday. A slight possibility of overnight plague mist. Um, 145 degrees, 52 percent chance of mild fire tornadoes. Chance of sizzling vapor winds, flesh melting UV rays, warning in effect, uh, chance of scalding acid rain. So it looks like, um, Earth, according to this, is all fucked. It is all fucked. <laughs> Which explains why we're doing a lot of space exploring. Fourth best. Fourth best at exploring. So, um, from Extra Reality Tours, are you desperate to escape the dismal drudgery of your daily grind but can barely find the time to even stop and think about how bored you are? Do you feel tired of being a lame, predictable, and overwhelmingly dull person? 
but don't have the cash to do something for, fun for once in your sad, pathetic life. Have you ever dreamt of navigating the lush foliage of the Amazon, filling the mist of Niagara on your face, or swimming among the vibrant colors of the Great Barrier Reef, only to remember that such wonders either burst into flames or sank into the ocean long ago, long, long ago? Let extra reality tours whisk you away by injecting your fantasy vacation straight into your brain. Enjoy perfect weather, visit impossible destinations, be an interesting person. The choice is yours. For a limited time, we're offering 50% off our Platinum Friendship Package. Simulate actual friends and fully immerse yourself in the wild fantasy that people like you and want to be around you. Wow. So, um, not only is Earth doom and gloom, um... It also has no social uh, social graces whatsoever, it seems. Oh, two new videos. Nobody works in here? Yeah, good to see you again, yes. I hope you're doing well, and thank you for your continued dedication. I'll keep it simple. The data you've gathered so far has set off an automated alarm in our system. We're not entirely sure why just yet, but inside that tower that you've discovered is something of immense potential. Get inside, find out what it is, and bring it back. There's a huge reward waiting for you if you do. Good luck. Okay, needless to say, I obviously do not uh, trust this guy in the least. Um, but let's see. Next one. Add, th add thoughts? Wipe them. Ill feelings? Wipe them. Tragic memories? Wipe them. Wipe them all away with Brain Wipe's disposable neural restimulation membrane. Just insert it to one orifice and pull out the other. We'll let our nano IntelliWeave fibers do the rest. I'm disgusting. Moisturizes as it soothes. Great for dry brains or stressful gatherings. This sucks. Brain Wipes intelligently navigates the interior sectors of your brain, removing any thoughts of malcontent, putting you back on the track to a positive outlook. Wipe away your worries with Brain Wipes emotional disinfectant smart tissues. Available in happy, apathetic, and sociopath. <laughs> that was great. Um, that was that was really great. Hold on, just a second. We'll get started again. Okay. Uh, let's actually check our upgrades real quick. So... Uh, aluminum... Aluminium. Mm. And again with the aluminium, I think. I don't exactly remember how we got the aluminum that we have now. Uh, yeah, we need some more aluminum. Just out ass aluminum, please. Yeah, so the broken bridge. That's exactly what I'm going to go to the broken bridge. Ambient temperature 92 degrees. Vital signs nominal. I apologize. I don't, I don't normally text, but right now I just need the text. Okay. Okay. I said my goodbyes. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Slap the shit out of that. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Ugh. Oh. My god. Okay, so what I need to do instead of trying to go for the and we're back. for the thing is actually uh grapple or uh, jump. Yeah, haha. Huh, huh. I came back, thank you. Can I leave now? Just wanna make it to the last checkpoint and see what there is out here. Ambient temperature 81 degrees. Bio signs nominal. 
Okay. Really? <laughs> yeah, so that's what I'm supposed to do. So, attempting to go for this. Ooh! What? Oh, I must have hit a death wall that quick. <laughs> That's a butt. Oh, is there a message for me? Yeah, it looks like there's a message. Um, hmm. Separately purchase each character, world element, model, and texture. Also coming soon. Mobile, 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 FPS, MMA, IV, GAF, or DHD, double D. The next level in hyper simulated nonsense. <coughs> it's not in the game. <laughs> that was great. Ooh. Wanna talk to some of the hottest slime forums in the galaxy? Chat with the most seductive soft bodies in space for a discreet and nebulous encounter. No bones about it. Call 1-900-LOVE-LOVE. <laughs> Just 2500 for the first minute and 42000 for each of the minutes. <laughs> Call the blog line now. That's great. That's, that's really great. Legitimately has a fidget spinner in the background. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Uh yeah. Back to the broken bridge. Again. <laughs> We're gonna get this damn broken bridge. There we fucking go. Hot damn. Okay. Now what? No. 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 You you make it oh fuck. Oh, well, I'm dead again. So you might get over the bridge, and that's it. That's literally it. Just remember you did your best. It wasn't very good, but it was your best. Walk it off. That's literally it. That is so dumb. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> okay. I was hoping the game wouldn't feel so linear, but I guess it really wants us to go to this next spot. I wonder how many zones there's going to be. I guess, uh, well, maybe five more? Four more? Including the landing? Uh, so five including the landing site would make sense. I'm sorry, guys. I'm super... Tired and heard my door slam in the background, so my kid's probably fucking with me. <clears throat> I 
I wake up at 4.30 in, or no, excuse me, I have to be there at 4.30 in the morning, I have to wake up at 3.30 in the morning. I don't know what that does. Hello, Silicon. Probably not a huge surprise, but that acid is going to eat through your suit if you don't upgrade your equipment. I'll mark the necessary ingredient on your map. Amazing! Well, this creature created armor from amber to protect itself. Let's kill it anyway. Acid, good for corpse creation and disposal. We will be able to get on to it along without an upgrade. Though, if you some data, Kindred might approve one. Okay, so that's how you kill those things. What is this? Fascinating. I am detecting elements of an ancient transmission from within the tower that seems to be localized within these tablets. My initial assessment is it is some kind of video coded. If you could find more of these, I will continue to decode and store them. Okay, cool. This new information is fascinating. I am cross-referencing it with our database of alien languages and attempting translation. I have also added a new folder to your desktop on the Javelin's computer. You can check out the results there at your leisure. Oh, that's right, get sniped. Okay, well, it won't let me, is the point, though. It also drops silicon, that new red one there. Okay. Keep going. I can put crap ton of silicon. percent poop Oh shit. Thing scared the crap out of me. 
Okay, so well, that was an aluminum thing. So what is this thing? Jeepers! That sure is a spooky gravestone. Hey. So nothing super special about it. Okay. I love how they turned something that wasn't dangerous into something dangerous. Hey, look at that. Ah, uh, how I've missed the cave ones. Okay. Okay, there we go. God, this, I, I have been turned around. I don't even know where I am anymore. The festering chasm. Mm, let me scratch my eye real quick.
even attempt to see where we're going now. Alright, so they're amber armor, and that is a comptivore. Okay. Oh, uh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, it's these things. Oh, I don't even know what the fuck that was. Alright, let's get some semblance of... That's right, kill that bitch. Ah, got it. Killed it again. Okay, so this whole time I thought it was the amber covered ones that were uh, doing it, and it was not. this thing that would be called a teleport what Ooh, a temporal fisher i've always wanted to see one of these what oh wow i'm so dead ow that hurt <laughs> okay Interesting. So I was wondering because she said all that earlier about I uh, the deaths being rude. I was wondering if uh, there would be any negative things happening because of how many times I die. You mean a game that punishes you for dying? That's fine. 
I want to go back to the javelin. I just want to get my shit first. So we're going to try to attempt to do that. Okay, I think we've safely made it back. Use the word safely very loosely. Damn it. Jesus Christ, the amount of shit going on around me right now. Oh shit! Did not realize he was like legitimately right next to me. Jesus! There we go. Please. <sighs> okay, guys. After that mild round of a heart attack that I had, uh, I think we're going to go back to the javelin habitat and probably end it there. See what they uh, want to talk about. Yeah, it was a surprise. Oh, yeah. 
I'm not used to coming in through the teleporter. Five minutes and 23 seconds. Time between report requests and your attendance. Okay. Let's begin. You've survived this journey entirely on your own thus far. How has this affected your mental state? Are you lonely? Depressed? Or are you relishing the opportunity to say problematic things aloud without being called out? It's great. <laughs> if you're lonely, you can always invite a friend. Or just grow more bitter and project your inadequacies onto other people via hate speech on social media. <laughs> That's great. You're keeping great pace, by the way. Quality RTA. Barely had time to read any donations. Number of updates granted. Very restrained in purchasing upgrades as well. I need aluminum. <laughs> Lifestyle Kindred rewards you with the more with less combination, which will be sent to your apartment on Earth in 17 separate pieces, each individually packaged using non biodegradable wrappers. And wow, you died a lot! You're the dyingest explorer. I'm the dyingest explorer. Have a kind day. Based on the data you've recovered so far, Kindred has confirmed my fears. They're not... Alien research. Transmission fragment number one. That's it so far. Interesting, interesting. Okay, guys. Well, we're going to call it a video there. Uh, thank you all for watching. Double check, uh, make sure we don't have any upgrades for it right now. We do not. Not yet. Oh, uh, that would be cool. But anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, do all that usual YouTube stuff. And this is Sneaky Narcotic, signing off.